Hello Orlando City fans, sign up so you don't miss out on news from our team. Past Results The Lions faced Charlotte FC twice in the inaugural 2022 expansion season, winning both times 2-1. The first confrontation between the two teams took place in April last year, with Facundo Torres scoring the decisive goal for the Lions at the Exploria Stadium. Nearly four months later, City traveled to Bank of America Stadium for the first time, where former Lions striker Tesho Akindali scored the winning goal in the 89th minute to send Orlando home with all three points. Already like the video, because it is very important for you not to miss the latest news from Leao that we posted here, thank you. Continuing. In the final stage. Saturday will serve as the final of five games for the Lions in a 15-day period between the CONCACAF Champions League and the MLS regular season. In that stretch, City traveled twice, first to Monterey for the SCCL round of 16 first leg against Tigres UANL, before heading to the nation's capital to face DC United in league play. Without taking goals. The Lions have yet to concede a home goal in MLS action this season, earning a 1-0 win over New York Red Bulls before a goalless draw with FC Cincinnati a week later. Goalkeeper Pedro Galiz was goalkeeper in each of those games without conceding a goal, for a total of 24 goals in all competitions for the Lions. Orlando City striker Erkan Kara opened his account for 2023 on Wednesday night when he scored in the 90th minute of City's Champions League game against Tigres UANL. Kara has 12 goals and 3 assists in all competitions in 2022 after joining City Beautiful last January. So Purple fan, does Orlando City have a squad to compete in the league? Will we need more reinforcements? Leave your comment below because it is very important for our team. Stay tuned, because I update you with all the news at any time.